Autopilot consists of features that make your car safer and more convenient to drive. We at Tesla are excited about the full self-driving future. Today, you must be fully attentive and have your hands on the yoke at all times while driving, regardless of what features are active. Safety is our number one priority. Not only is your car remarkably effective at keeping you and your passengers safe in the event of a collision, it also has active safety features that help you avoid collisions altogether. You can review and toggle these features from the Autopilot menu. Available driver assistance features vary depending upon the car's configuration. Be sure to look for them on the Autopilot menu so you know how your Tesla is equipped and so you can enable the features you'd like to use. If you learn about a feature from these videos that isn't on your Tesla, we might be able to add it via an over-the-air software update. Explore upgrades in the Tesla app. It's easiest to think of Autopilot's driver assistance features as advanced versions of cruise control. Like when using traditional cruise control, you are always in charge of what your car is doing and you need to be ready to take action at any moment. The features make your driving easier and more relaxing. We'll cover a few of the most commonly used features here. Traffic Aware Cruise Control, or TAC for short, adjusts speed based upon the vehicles ahead of you. When TAC is available, a gray number appears near your speedometer here. This number is your set speed, the fastest your Tesla will travel when TAC is engaged. You can adjust set speed preferences and others from the Autopilot menu. While TAC is active, you can lift off the pedals and your Tesla will travel at the set speed when the road is open and will slow down as necessary for curves and traffic in your lane ahead. TAC responds to most objects, but can't recognize everything, so be ready to take over as needed. TAC does not attempt to slow for traffic lights, stop signs, or other traffic controls unless your car is equipped with traffic light and stop sign control and has this feature enabled. Auto Steer builds upon Traffic Aware Cruise Control by adding steering assistance. A gray steering yoke icon appears here when Auto Steer is available. To activate both TAC and Auto Steer, press in on the right scroll wheel. The TAC icon, Auto Steer icon, and the lane lines in the driving visualization turn blue. As its name suggests, Auto Steer automatically moves the yoke to keep you centered in your lane. It does the work of constantly adjusting steering for you, so you can just lightly hold the yoke and scan your surroundings so you're ready in case you need to take over. To change your set speed while driving, scroll up or down using this control. Adjust your following distance from the Autopilot menu. If your Tesla doesn't detect your hands on the yoke while using Auto Steer, it will prompt you to apply more force to the yoke. It's measuring the small amount of resistance from your hands, so light turning force will clear this prompt. If you repeatedly ignore these warnings, you're using Auto Steer unsafely and will be locked out from using it for the rest of your trip. To deactivate TAC and Auto Steer, press in the scroll wheel again, or gently press the brake pedal. If you'd like to be able to use Traffic Aware Cruise Control without Auto Steer, go to Controls, Autopilot, and then set Auto Steer Activation to Double Click. Now, a single press of the scroll wheel will activate Traffic Aware Cruise Control only, so you can lift off the pedals while still providing all steering inputs. A double press of the scroll wheel will activate Auto Steer. To deactivate Auto Steer while leaving Traffic Aware Cruise Control on, apply a greater amount of turning force to the yoke. As before, pressing in the scroll wheel once or gently pressing the brake pedal deactivates both TAC and Auto Steer. If your Tesla is equipped with auto lane change, a press of the turn signal while auto steer is on initiates an automatic lane change. Check your mirrors and blind spot as you would normally. Press the turn signal when there's space and, with your supervision, your Tesla will automatically move one lane over and continue to steer in the new lane. The hardware on new cars needs to calibrate before features like TAC and auto steer are available. This one-time self-calibration completes within an hour of driving on well-marked roads. The gray icons won't appear until the required calibration has completed. Auto Steer also needs to be enabled from the Autopilot menu. As a reminder, more details about active safety and driver assistance features can be found in your on-screen owner's manual.